One of the messages that I hope to bring to you today is that there are some principles of learning that really haven't changed. And one of the ways that we can use technology is to do the things that we've always known are best for children. And now technology really allows us to do that well and easily so that we don't have to um, stay up all night to do the kind of differentiated instruction and the kind of, of problem-based learning and authentic learning that we really want to do. So I hope that that's, those are some of the things that you get out of this. One of the other reasons that I call this, um, this, to this topic the differentiators is I think we have to be careful about how we use technology in schools. And we have to make sure that it doesn't detract from the instructional time that we have with students, but instead that it's a powerful motivator and leverager for what we're doing um, in schools. And so we have to make some strategic decisions. And um, although I oftentimes wish I had a 12-year-old around to kind of set my VCR and set up my iPhone in ways that I really want, the reality is that we, all of us in, our, in this room as, as adults and educators, have a responsibility to make sure that we know enough about that technology to lead students in, in very powerful ways with that. Because the reality is even though we say these kids are very... Um, good with technology. The reality is that they're very facile with it, but they frankly don't know how to learn with it very well. And it's our responsibility to really move that in the direction.